He's got his work cut out for him, though, when he faces the ring veteran wrestling to the living legend. And I wonder how many bouts and matches and situations wrestling two has been in across the years, literally thousands. We're talking today that at one point, the fans awarded him the champion of champions trophy because he did defeat the NWA world champion Harley Race yes. right in the middle of the ring in the Atlanta City Auditorium. Uh, because of some uh, politics in the uh, ruling, uh, he did not get the title, but the fans felt like he deserved it. And they came up with the champion of champions uh, trophy, which Stu still has in his home. And uh, that's something he's very proud of. Right, and I'm sure he has many other trophies and belts that he perhaps has retired and has in his home. Uh, Wrestling 2 lives in the city of Atlanta. He has a new partner, a new Mr. Wrestling number one. And we're hoping in the near future we might be able to see him uh, in action here at Peach Day Wrestling too. So if you see Ben Masters, ask him about it and see if he can get him. Whoa! Wrestling too, practically standing up on his man, pulls him over. This man's very athletic, very agile, and quick as a cat. Yes, he is. It's an exciting night at the National Guard Armory in Cordial, Georgia. Ten minutes have expired. Twenty minutes remain. Ten minutes gone in this 30-minute one-fall match. Look at Lawler. Now the crowd picks up the chant. What is Billy White asking for? Timeout? <laughs> you won't find it here. No. Sure. Need to go to basketball or some other place. There are no timeouts in wrestling. It's from the opening bell to somebody gets pinned. It is all out, no holds barred. Shoots him in, wrestling two, catches him right in the bread basket. Hard right hand, body slam. Up. Hard slam. Oh. And Lawler's absorbing a lot of punch. Oh! A right hand to the forehead of Lawler, and you can hear that pop all the way over here at the announcing table. Now they've got two back to that corner. The tag out to White. And he's working on the midsection of wrestling two. He's in no man's land in that corner and did very good to get out. Kicks Billy White as he came in. And a headlock and wrestling oh. two. You can hear that one echo all over the building. Wrestling two has a powerful right hand. And he just caught dirty Billy White right in the forehead. Whap! You could hear it all the way over here at the announcing table. And we're a good 25 feet away from the action in the ring. Again. Now they've got man. wrestling two caught in the corner, and Sean O'Brien, the catcher, is distracted. <laughs> two is reeling. <laughs> Brian says, you got to get him out of the corner. And now his back is turned. Dirty Billy White works on the throat of wrestling two. Is that a chokehold, Ben? I do believe so. Referee warning him and gave him a count on that. He did have a four count to release, or he would have been disqualified for right. that choke Now, Brett Sawyer tries to get the clap going. Two, two. You can hear the crowd picking up the chant. And look at Wrestling 2 trying to power his way out as he hears the crowd saying, two, two, two. So this team of Billy White and Steve Lawler have been tag teaming in different areas around uh, South Georgia, North Georgia, up in Tennessee and Alabama, and they are no strangers to each other. And now you can see how well they work as a tag team unit. They certainly do, and they've managed to keep two in their corner. You do not want to get caught in your opponent's corner. That's the wrong place to be. And two knows it. He up. Oh! Reverse play as he slams Billy White to the mat. Both men are dazed. Two trying to get to his feet. White still on the mat, trying to get up. Two obviously dazed. Look out, Lawler gets two and drags his neck right down across that rope. Sean O'Brien really has his work cut out for him in this match because these two gentlemen will break every rule in the book, Phil. They will do anything to win at any cost, and nothing would please them more than to defeat a veteran of the statue of wrestling too, and of course a very popular favorite like Brett Sawyer. Now the crowd trying to get the chant going. Two, two, you can hear them yelling, and wrestling two trying 
trying to get some resiliency going, pull something out here. He lifts Lawler for the atomic, whoa! He went right over the top rope, the impact of that knee uh, into that uh, gluteus maximus, and uh, right now wrestling two being choked on the ropes. Brett Sawyer comes in, the referee sends him back, and two's in trouble. Lawler is pounding on two. A switch, Phil. There was well, not a tag made, a switch. A switch, and I'm not sure Sean O'Brien's going to allow it. No tag, and the fans saw it. There was no tag. I'm not sure the fans saw it. Two has it in the ropes. Crisscross. Oh! The two men collide right in the middle of the ring, and you talk about two locomotives that just ran into each other. Two and Steve the Brawler Lawler. 15 minutes gone, 15 remains. Both men struggling, trying to get to their feet. Can two get up? He needs to stay out of that enemy corner. He needs to tag out the Sawyer. Two is staggered on his feet. He's trying to make the tag. They do. Both men tag. And here comes Sawyer. He's going to ram their heads together. Whoa, look at Brett Sawyer. He is like a house of fire. Right into the rope. The body slam. Now he gives Lawless a couple of chops to the head. Now two is in the ring. We've got all four men. All four men at the same time. We've got Chaos and Bedlam. It's all breaking loose right here tonight. And Sean O'Brien doesn't know who to look at first. Sawyer and White with the two, a Lawler with the two men in title will be in the ring. But now you got the other two. Now what is Steve Lawler doing over here, Phil? Well, Steve Lawler, Lawler is, is doing something. something. He has got some kind of foreign He loaded that elbow pad, Phil. Something he is loaded that elbow, elbow pad. pad. Two, three, Steve Lawler put something in that elbow and pad. Two caught him with a knee as he came up. Two caught Billy White with a knee. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner is Steve Lawler and Billy, Billy White. And boy, I'll tell you right now, the fans are upset about that. They're trying to tell Sean O'Brien that was definitely in that elbow pad. That Lawler loaded that elbow pad and slammed Brett Wayne Sawyer's head into it. The fans are upset about that. Two is still in the ring. He's looking at the head of Brett Sawyer, and he received a vicious blow. Some sort of metal object, I'm almost sure, was shoved into the pad of that elbow. You're watching Wrestlerama on TV 55.